welcome back, everybody. So today we have the Kyosho Sandmaster 2.0 Easy Series. So I was watching uh, Joe over at Joe vs. RC, and this popped up on his channel about a week ago. And, uh, ooh, I, I, I need one of those. So well, a week later, here we are. And these, I got this thing off of eBay. It was here within a week, $140. And for a ready-to-run, two-wheel drive, sand rail looking buggy, I don't think that's bad at all. So we're not going to really dwell on it a whole lot as far as unboxing goes. We're just going to take a quick look. It does come with a 40 amp, says waterproof ESC, we'll find out. And then we got a nice set of oil shocks and... A little battery cover there is kind of interesting. When I get it out, we'll have a look at that. I already looked at it, and it's kind of strange. And you get a 540. It says G22, so I don't know if they mean 22 turn. I don't really know a whole lot about their, their motor specifications. And it says it has a waterproof steering servo, a 6-gram servo. And then you get your 2.4 gigahertz radio. And I got it in the white. Uh, let me get this thing popped open, and we'll have a quick look at it, and then we'll we'll get it out and run it. Just a quick peek inside the box. I mean, they, they did a really nice job on packing this thing up, too. I mean, that, that's pretty good packing. So here's what the beauty looks like outside of the box. I really like the, the body style on this. I'm a big fan of sand rails. And it looks like the on and off button's hidden right back here. Everything looks pretty good. These tires actually feel really nice. I don't know whether they're real bead locks or simulated, but it definitely has the beads in place. So at some point, I'll have to do some inspecting on those. I mean, of course, it's going to bounce a little more in the rear. That's where all the weight's at. But I was saying our kind of a strange battery system here. Well, it looks like you have to push this button in and slide this forward, which is gonna be oh, there we go. Really kind of kind of a weird thing. So uh, I'll have to get used to messing with that and get it figured out to where I can do it much easier. But we also get, here's our radio, and it feels surprisingly comfortable. It's not too big. It fits in the hand really nice. Um, I mean, not that you do a whole lot of one-handed driving, but you could if you wanted to. And it has all of your different adjustments, your trims, uh, steering trim, throttle trim, and then it looks like we have the amount of steering and the uh, the endpoints for the steering and the throttle, plus all of your reversing and your bind button. And they give you two binding plugs just in case. So let me get a battery in this and let's get out and run it. All right, so uh, surprise, it's not really a Sandmaster, it's a Snowmaster. So it's got pretty responsive steering. I already got thrown out of the house for doing donuts in the kitchen, so so we're out here in the snow now. Yeah, let's give it a give it a little rip. It's kind of a chattery thing. Whoa, we got her stuck. Now, I don't know if it's supposed to be that chattery or not. having a hard time in this snow. Might have to skip that part. Oh, 
I think it's going to be pretty fun. This is some pretty sloppy snow though. But it does seem kind of a loud on the gearbox. stuck so let's get this thing out on the road and see what it does okay so we're out on the road the thing drives great uh, I just think the the gearbox does seem excessively loud to me maybe it's supposed to be that way I'm not sure but let, let's give it a rip I wonder if maybe they didn't put any grease in it or something. Maybe something's rubbing on something. I'm definitely going to have to do some inspecting. It doesn't seem to be affecting the way it drives. But all right, everybody. There's a, our first run of the... Yosho Sam Master 2.0. I have a brushless system I'm wanting to put in this thing, so we'll see how that turns out. So stay tuned for weird noise inspection and brushless conversion in the future. Have a great day, guys. Hit that like, hit that subscribe. I'll see you on the next one.